challenges of using the Socratic method with elementary school-aged children. While the Socratic method offers many benefits, there are challenges to consider when using it with young children. Attention span. Young children may have shorter attention span, so it's important to keep discussions focused and engaging. Break up longer discussions with activities or movements to maintain their interest. Developmental appropriateness. Be mindful of developmental stages of your students. Tailor your questions to their cognitive abilities and be patient as they learn to engage with more complex ideas. Classroom management. Socratic discussions can become lively, so it's important to establish clear guidelines for respectful listening and participation. Teach your students, no matter how young they are, how to take turns speaking and how to respond to each other in constructive ways. Patience and time. Employing the Socratic method requires patience, as children may need more time to reflect on and answer the questions. It may also require repetition and clarification to help children grasp the intent of the inquiry. Concrete thinking. Young children tend to think in concrete terms rather than abstract ideas or concepts. The Socratic method often encourages exploring hypothetical or philosophical ideas, which may be difficult for younger children to engage with meaningfully. Language skills. The Socratic method relies heavily on verbal exchanges, and young children are still developing their vocabulary and expressive language abilities. They may struggle to articulate their thoughts or fully grasp the questions being posed. But with careful adaptation and consideration of the developmental needs of young learners, the Socratic method can be a valuable addition to any classroom, especially elementary education.